like to smell that or it might be too strong for them. So those are all of those logistics. Another thing is, if you're in Belgrade at the Red Onion, you know where the parking lot is, you know where you're going. But what if you're going to the Mayo Hospital, Mayo Clinic in Rochester? You might have to park in a ramp to get to your interview. You might have to park a long ways away. You might need money for parking. These are things that you want to think about before the interview starts so that you can be ready for that. Okay? What time should you get there? Now, if the weather is bad, sometimes it can happen that you're running late. You walk in five minutes before the interview, you tell the receptionist, I'm here for my interview, the road was really bad. I, you know, in fact, like this morning it was slippery. I saw a rollover on my way here. You know, it might slow me down for the interview. Okay, then I sit down, the employer or the supervisor comes out, I'm all composed and ready to go. But when you leave, that supervisor says to the receptionist, what did you think of her? Well, you know, she just showed up five minutes before the interview. She was all flustered. She almost was late. That looks bad, okay? You want to be there about 15 to 20 minutes sitting in the lobby waiting for the interview, okay? So there's so many things for preparation to get ready for that job interview. Now, I mentioned the third thing, and that's probably the big tip that I want to tell you about. I told you I'm going to give you one tip. The night before or the day before your job interview, think about your stories. Okay? Your good stories, your bad stories, your stories you've had in jobs while you've been in high school, projects you've done in school, once you go to college, some of the volunteering you've done, or maybe you volunteer now, but all of the stories. Think about the beginning of the story, the end of the story, and what your role in that story was. And I'm going to explain that in a minute why. Okay, so you come into the, you're sitting in the lobby, Supervisor comes out ready to interview, right? So you're going to stand up. If it's winter time, you probably have your jacket over your arm or on, you'll put it on the back of a chair. If you have a purse, you're going to carry it but put it down on the floor. Um, first thing is smiling, right? Good eye contact. And very professional courtesy is to do what? Shake hands, right? Let's try to get a little tighter. Just say hi, my name is Matthew. Nice to meet you. 